one tip use it before you go to sleep or when you're not hello this is Sarah JM again with another Thursday vlog just came out of work and I'm going to um, prepare some dinner an easy simple dinner I bought some chicken and chicken wings from the little and I have some sweet potatoes and I have some seasoning for the chicken and this is from Maggi and it's called Braadstomer so you're steaming the chicken and you need to um, put it in a bag put the, put the seasoning in it and then um, just leave it in for like an hour or something but a lot of people are saying to me like no, this has no flavor and stuff and uh, there's no point of buying it I want to show you guys how to make it more tasteful so just a way to do it and let's see what else yeah and I have some leftover rice so I'm going to uh, see what I'm going to do with that I'm going to add it to this meal so I already started cutting the potatoes and added some leftover vegetable to it some broccoli and some carrots so yeah I just used one of these sweet potatoes or because I didn't want the bag to be heavy because if the bag if the bag it's very fragile gets too heavy then it will break and then your then it's going to be useless of course so uh, and I think they're only it's meant for like 500 grams so yeah let's see if it all will fit um, and if not, I can use it for tomorrow. So yeah, I'm going to open it. And of course, I already put on the oven. Yeah. Be very careful, or else it will. So, this is not like a very special meal, but it's a simple, easy meal to prepare. It's also healthy. So, yeah. Put this aside and then put that. Yeah. Potatoes and vegetables aside, and let me start cleaning the kitchen or the chicken. So here's my chicken cleaned, and let's see. Yeah, so first, going to make some small cuts into the chicken to make sure <clears throat> it's not a big thick piece of chicken there's not a lot to cut in but I just cut it to make sure um, I don't know if seasoning is even the right word but the stuff that's in the bag that it gets between the meat for extra flavor. I normally buy my meat at the halal store. And there's a whole lot of meat of it on it. A whole lot more meat on it. So maybe so I'm gonna try it with the little for once. So I've cleaned the kitchen, uh, the kitchen again. So I've cleaned the chicken, <coughs> made them, um, made a few cuts in them, so the, <coughs> so the stuff can slide in more in the chicken, and will give you extra flavor. Let's see, let's see, the leftovers. So I'm going to put these in, as you can 
empty, they're flat. Now in the meantime, I'm going to uh, take a shower, moisturize my hair. So I'm just done with um, taking a shower and brushing my hair and now I'm going to moisturize it. So um, you've already seen this passing by. I still need to finish this. But you've already seen this pass by in my previous video and this is the Amla oil and this is just good to moisturize the hair especially when it's dry and um, it has dead ends or something then it's good to uh, use it and especially uh, it's 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 meant for every um, type of hair but I think it's especially good for black hair because um, black hair is by nature dry so it needs a lot of nutrition and this has a lot of nutrition in it so yeah I'm going to uh, start. Uh, all right, just let me finish the small one. I'm going to start um, putting it in my hair. So I'm not sure if this is the best combination: cooking food and doing my hair. <laughs> Weird, but hey, that's just me. So normally I do this in the bathroom. Okay this in the bathroom it's very dangerous to do this in my couch but the lightning in my bathroom is like very very bad so let me just do it here so i'll just make sure I'll, i put this on my um the, the, the skin on my head the scalpel This is also good for when you're uh, starting to get bold. So I just finished putting in the amla oil and um, just one tip, use it before you go to sleep or when you're not planning to leave the house because the smell is like horrible but it's so worth it because you know it, it, it gives my hair some extra fullness and it, it you know uh, moisturizes the dead ends and stuff or the yeah whatever but it helps but you just need to use it before you go to sleep or when you're planning not to leave the house so yeah and yeah it's 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 also not um something that will you know like style your hair and like a nice model or something it's just to nurture it or to nurture it yeah so um you can leave it in for like 20 minutes or something but i'll just uh, leave it in all night to give it um yeah to let it work in a little bit extra and yeah, what I also use nowadays, you guys have also seen this passing by in my uh, previous video, is, oh, I love how they packed it this time. They gave an extra travel, uh, an extra travel, how do you call it? Uh, a travel size uh, thing, so you could just put it in your bag. I think it looks cute. So when you open it from the other side, and the big one so yeah so in the front of my hair I'm a little bit more frizzy than the rest of my hair so what I always used to do I used to uh, put like that normal cheap gel on it and I would comb it like this or when I would blow dry or iron my hair I would just put some extra blow dry on it or heat it up extra to get it you know like straight but um, as you get older, yeah, I'm still young, but not the youngest. Um, your hormones started starting to act up, and they're saying like, uh, "Well, I'm done with uh, renewing the hair in that area." So uh, that's what happened. It happened to me. So um, it nurses it. So um, it gives you some proteins, 
which make the hair uh, grow in this area so it's specially made for that area so yeah I'll just step it up I usually do this in the morning but since I'm doing my hair right now I can just show you so because I was losing like hair at this side and then I started using this and it helps so so when you're ready at the face that you're losing hair you can just tap it up on the areas where you lost the hair so like this and now I'm going to put on this scarf on my head because uh, like I said the amla oil is like really strong so um, when you um, sleep with it and you don't put anything on your head the next morning your pillow will be green so this is what I do to uh, keep my pillows clean it looks weird but hey it's so worth it you know because when I go out my hair always looks like well taken care of and that's because I just yeah do these kinds of things looks weird but hey beauty has a price I was so frying some onions. I know it sounds gross, but it's so good for your immune system. It gets way stronger. And voila, this is it. So it's quite simple to prepare. So you have some vitamin C, vitamin D, you have proteins in it. So easy and healthy. You can also add a little bit of ketchup to it. I love to eat that with my rice and onions. And, um, yeah, let me add a little bit to it. Ooh, oh, things are falling. Yeah, so a little bit. And yeah, the leftovers I just saved for tomorrow. I can eat that at tomorrow's uh, lunch at work. So that would save me money because then I don't need to go out and buy food. Well, so I'm going to uh, finish this meal and uh, thank you for watching. Don't forget to check out my blog www.sarahjm.net and uh, for the YouTubers, don't forget to subscribe and thank you for the ones who already did. And um, that was about it. So uh, thank you for watching and um, ciao!